I'm gonna be opening birthday presents from you guys. Um, and holy crap, again, thank you guys so much. You guys are so freaking sweet to me. Like, thank you for the gifts and the cards and for all the happy birthday wishes on all the social media. Like, I don't know what I did to deserve you guys' kindness and your love and your generosity, but holy shit. Thank you. I am seriously like the luckiest girl in the world to have you guys because you guys are freaking awesome. Ah, thank you. Oh. <laughs> okay, so first I'm going to start with uh, the cards. This first one is from Brian S. Oh, it's got pictures of two little baby puppies. Two little baby golden retrievers. So cute. And it says, with warmest thoughts and best wishes for a day as wonderful as you. Happy birthday from Brian. Thank you. Thank you so much. Oh, wait. Oh, this is even cooler! The center of this card is a supporter of the Guiding Eyes for the Blind, one of the nation's foremost guide dog schools. That is so awesome! Um, one of my little sisters is in school right now in Wilmington to become a vet, and what she's doing with like all of her free time is she's working with the local um, guide dog and service dog school there, and she's like taking dogs or puppies in and helping train them to become guide dogs and service dogs. So this is really awesome. Thank you. Okay, the next one is a postcard that my good friend Dan made, and it's 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 awesome. Um, it says, check out my sweet vintage RachelCon postcard. This was back before they got off commercial. Those were the real RachelCons, man. Also, happy birthday. Um, <laughs> and it says, RachelCon, May 18th, my birthday, uh, 2010, at the Racheltown Convention Center, presented in part by the Morseketeers. Oh, that's so cute. Costume contest with guest judge, Rachel. Rachel panel hosted by Rachel. <laughs> Rachelie, Rachel Tastic Rachelness. Oh my god, that's a whole lot of my names. Look at this. That's that's so awesome. Thank you, Dan. I love this. I'm gonna cherish this forever. This is this is perfect. Thank you. Next I have an envelope here from Brandon. And it's from Koala Art. Uh Koala Art's this store on uh store Envy and she makes really awesome like Zelda dresses and stuff that I've said for love. Oh, and look, it comes in a little baggie. Oh my god, I love this, Brandon! Oh, thank you! It's an 8-bit heart necklace that I really, really wanted. Look! Look how pretty! Ah! Thank you so much! This is perfect! I'm gonna wear it right now. I love this! Thank you! Yay! Thank you so much. It's perfect. Thank you. Next, I have another envelope from Matt. Oh, thank you, Matt. Ooh, this is looks and fancy. Oh, that's just a catalog. <laughs> Not the catalog. Catalog fancy. Oh, oh, this is so cute. <gasps> Look. Okay, hold on. I have to open it and show you. Definitely gonna do a photo shoot in these, hundred percent. Look, it's it's these underwears, these little panties, and when you put them on, they they form a heart. Your butt, your butt comes through, and your butt makes a heart like this. <laughs> I can't show you with it. It's like that. See, and then you you got a heart butt. Oh my god, these are so cute. Oh wait, I think I was holding them up wrong. I think it's well, hi Yoshi. <laughs> she just jumped the whole thing. Hi. What's up? Give me a kiss. Thank you. These are so cute. I love these. Definitely gonna do a photo shoot in them. They're perfect. Thank you. But that's not all. There's more. Yoshi, do you mind? Do you mind? Oh, that is so pretty. You got me a bunch of stuff to do in photo shoots in. <laughs> oh my god, look. Oh shit, that is that is sexy. I like the back too. The back is all straps. See? Do, 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 do. Thank you so much. This is really pretty. I like this. Okay, I'm gonna do a shoot in that too, for sure. Because that's that's too pretty not to shoot in. I love it. Thank you. And then lastly, some super super cute socks. Oh I love these. They're pink knee socks with little pink hearts. Oh, I love them. Anything pink. Whoa, actually, I've got a lot of stuff pink already. That's perfect. I love it. I love my socks. I love my sexy little outfit. And my butt panties. 
to turn my butt into a heart. I love it. Thank you, Matt. Next, I have a box from Steel Series. Um, Steel Series is my all-time favorite gaming peripheral maker of stuff. <laughs> I use their headsets. I use their mouse, their keyboard. I love them. And no, I do not get paid to say that. It'd be nice if I did, but no, I don't. I actually genuinely, this is not a sponsorship message. This is me saying, yes, I love Steel Series. Um, and they sent me some new headsets. Art Artist 5 Surround Surround Sound Gaming Headset. Works for Windows, Xbox, PlayStation, Mobile, and VR. Oh my god, thank god. I needed some new headsets for my Xbox so bad. The one I've been using are terrible. They hurt my head after like just 15 minutes. That's what I love about my, my gaming PC headsets from Steel Series. Is I can wear them forever and they're so cushy and nice and comfy. And they have lights on them. I think these have lights on them too. It looks like they do. Yeah, I I absolutely love Steel Series. I tried several other companies um, stuff and uh, you know you kind of got to find a company that makes stuff that you really like. I tried Turtle Beach, Logitech of course, um, Turtle Beach and Razer and uh, I mean their stuff was really good. Uh, Turtle Beach's headsets were awesome um, but they just kept breaking. And it wasn't until I started using Steel Series that I was like, yep, I'm sticking with these guys. And then that's why I got everything. I got my keyboard and my mouse through them as well because I love it. Wow, these are so nice. Oh, they're so cushy. Little mic here. Yeah, these are these are gonna be my Xbox gaming headset for sure. Yeah, absolutely. Yeah, I can turn the mic on up, up, down, charging cable. Ooh. Yeah, these are nice. <laughs> Most headsets look big on me, but that's because I have a super tiny head. Yay, I love them. Oh my god. Thank you, Steel Series. Thank you. Now I finally got myself a good headset for my Xbox. It makes me much happier. And then this box is from I don't know. Aw, a gift for you. Happy birthday, Rachel. I hope you have a great birthday. Thank you. This goes with a gift I sent you a while back. I hope you enjoy it. Love you, proud patron and lifelong fan, Blake S. Oh, thank you, Blake. I like the little baggie. I'm going to reuse the baggie. Okay. <laughs> oh, my God. It does. It goes perfectly with the thing. I think you sent it to me for Christmas, right? You sent me a pink kitty cat peach. And now... A yellow Mario kitty cat. Oh my god, this is so perfect. I love it. Let's get him out of there. Oh, he's so soft. I love him. He's the best. He's gonna love hanging out with my peach kitty cat. Thank you so much, Blake. I absolutely adore him. I love him. He's so squishable. Yay, thank you. Here's, an here's another box from um, Amazon. Ooh, another fancy bag I'm gonna keep. <laughs> it says, hi Rachel, hi. <laughs> Books transport us back and forth to the farthest reaches of time. So these seem appropriate, plus they are cool, like you. Oh, from Steve Smithers. Oh, thank you. Oh my God, I've wanted these forever. Oh my God, they're the portal bookends. Oh my God, this is so perfect. See, it's like the bot, he want this little portal man. He's going in this one end and he's coming out the other end because he portaled through all of my books. Oh, bless you. <laughs> this is amazing. Oh my god, I've wanted these for so ever. Thank you so much. Oh my god. How fun is that? See? Oh my god. This is amazing. Thank you so much. This is perfect. This is perfect, perfect. Thank you. I know exactly which shelf I'm gonna use these on. These are gonna go. I have a um a shelf. This is actually going to be um, ends of instead of books, but some of my games because I have a shelf where it's like my portal display shelf where I've got all like my games and stuff in it. But on top is where I've got my portal gun. Um, what else do I have up there? I have some other portal stuff up there. I can't remember what all I have. But um, oh, of course, a companion cube 
Uh, and I can't remember what else I've got up there, but it's portally stuff. So this is 100% going to be on that shelf. Thank you so much. Next is a box from Rich. There's actually two boxes. Um, and I'm gonna do this one first, and then the second box is at the bottom of this stack. So yeah, we'll get to this one now. There's a bag of something. Ooh. <laughs> a new USB drive, G drive. Oh my God, four terabyte. <gasps> is this, is this from, is this, is this, is this for my PlayStation? My PS4? Because I've been needing a drive for that for so long. I think it is. Really? Oh my God. Oh my God, I've been needing that for so, so, so long. I've been having to delete games. I hate deleting games. I know that you can always just download them again later, but I don't like doing that once I download something. I want it on there forever. Um, my PS4 has been needing a drive for like since the beginning of time. So this is amazing. Yes, thank you so much. Thank you so much. I don't have to delete games anymore just to play a new one. <gasps> I see clap trap. What is this? Oh my god. It's a clap trap travel. Ugh, how do you say that? Clap trap travel bag. Oh my god. How did I not know this existed? I thought I knew everything Borderlands that existed. It's got a little Hyperion tag. Oh my god, look at this. Look at this, it's Claptrap. Oh! It's got a little front pocket here, so you can put like things in there. I don't know, like a charger cable or something. But he is definitely coming with me next time I go anywhere. Oh my god, it's got another little front pocket here that's padded for other things that you want to put in there. And then it's got the main pocket that has other little pocket things, like a little zipper pocket and a little stash for everything. This is amazing. Yay, thank you. Oh, he's definitely coming with me next time I go anywhere. I love him. Look at, he's so cute, my little claptrap. I love it. Thank you. I can't believe I didn't know about that. How did I not know about something? Borderlands. That's insane. Oh, here's something. Oh, what a sweet baby. It's a little sister dorms. Look at, that's definitely going on my Bioshock shelf. Oh my God, it is totally a dorms. That is so cute. Yay, I love everything Bioshock. Thank you, I didn't know about this either. Oh my God, they've also got Booker, Elizabeth, and Big Daddy. Holy crap, adorable. One more thing. I think this is the Big Daddy dorm. I think. Oh, I hope it's It is! Ah! It is so fucking cute. Dorbs XL. Oh my god. Look at his big fat head. That is so cute. Oh my god. I love this. I love it so much. You're going on my Bioshock show too, you cutie pie. Thank you so much. Thank you! I got something here. Uh, it doesn't say. Who's this from? Oh, this is from Mark. Thank you, Mark. It says, there's no place I can be since I found Serenity. Aw, but you can't take the sky from me. My sky is always brighter with your next stream on the horizon. Oh, thank you. Have an amazing birthday. Love, Mark. Oh, my God. That is the sweetest thing ever. I'm so going to save that. You combine one of my favorite things in the world, which is Firefly slash Serenity, with with nice words about me, so thank you. This is super sweet. Does that mean there's something Firefly Serenity in here? No way. Oh my god. Oh my god, Mark. No way. Oh my god. I didn't want to rip the paper. It was so pretty, but I can't help myself. my god it's the serenity ship from quantum mechanics oh my god look you have no idea how cool this is ah i don't even know what to say i don't even begin to know what to say this is freaking amazing oh it's one of two thousand 
This one's number 90 of 2000. Number 90? That's a low number. That's a really, that's first hundred. Yes. Oh my God, this is beautiful. Oh shit, all these little parts that I'm put together with a really cool stand. Look, look at that. Oh my God, that's so cool. This little thing is magneted and, and you can pop it off and you can see inside like their little lunchroom thing. See where they ate and stuff? Oh my God. Oh, and this is a little, this is like a little escape pod. Ooh, that moves. Oh, that's so cool. Ooh. And then here's a little ship thing. Oh, it goes on the side. Does it go forward or backwards? Okay. And then there's another one. Oh, here's another escape pod. A little army do. Where's that arm do go? In here, like that. And this little leg. I think goes on the bottom. Yeah, because it's like a little landing leg. Another one of those. Another landing leg. This is so amazing. Oh my god. This is beyond amazing. I have, I, oh my god. Oh my god. Thank you so much, Mark. I love, love, love this. The amount of detail on this is ridiculous. Like, just look. I, <laughs> it looks a little lopsided because I didn't put it together all the way. But this is beyond perfect. Holy crap. This is amazing. I absolutely love this. I, I, I can't even tell you how much I love it. It's perfect. I, it's just so awesome. Thank you so much, Mark. Thank you so much. Ah! And then I got a little box. Does not say. Which one? Uh, this one. Oh, this one's from Matt. Oh, thank you. More stuff. <gasps> Matt. Oh my God. I wanted it for so long. This is amazing. This is perfect. It's Cami Hello Kitty. This is so great. <laughs> I'm gonna do a Cami Hello Kitty cosplay. That'd be so funny. Look at her. She's so furious. Look, is that not the cutest thing you've ever seen? You know this is the cutest thing you've ever seen. I love that you know the little triangle that Cami has on her bodysuit? This one's actually a heart. And oh my god, that's just too she's adorable. She's Oh, they've got Hello Kitty, Chun-Li, um, Ken, Ryu, oh, I don't know who that is. They've got pretty much everybody, but this is, this is perfect. I love her so much. Ah, this is just, ah, look at her. <laughs> Thank you so much, Matt. Then I got this Tubin. Um, this is from Fierce Beast. And I'm really interested to see what this is. I don't think I've ever gotten anything in a tube before. Oh my god. <laughs> I love this. This is the cutest thing. Oh my god. It's a quaggin from Guild Wars 2, which is my favorite race in the whole wide world. Second to Ewoks, my favorite race in Guild Wars 2. Look at that. It's a quaggin. I love this. Oh my god, Pierce, this is perfect. This is perfect. This is, ah, this is perfect. I love him so much. Oh. Oh my god. He is definitely, oh my goodness. Where's the perfect place to put a bag in? I want to put him above my makeup counter over there. My little vanity. Yes, yes, so then I can look at my quaggin every morning when I wake up. Because that will be sure to put me in a good mood every single morning is waking up to a quaggin face. I love this. Thank you so much. Quaggins are the best. Quaggins are really, really the best. Oh, this is from Miss Jean and Mr. Bill and Smug Dog. Thank you, guys. You guys always send me so much cool stuff. Man, look at all this. What is this? It's a Darth Vader voice changing bo box. Oh my god, it's like a it's like a smoke mask or whatever. Gas mask. 
Oh man, I don't have any batteries that are gonna fit it. I wanted to do the sounds for you guys. But this doesn't take double A's, it's triple A's. I don't think I have any triple A's. I'm always out of batteries. Always, always, always. Every time one of my Xbox controllers battery dies, I'm like having to run around the house seeing what I can steal batteries out of. But this is super fun. I'll have to snapshot it. Look. I'll, I'll, I'll just do the sound for you. There you go. <laughs> Come to the dark side. This is so fun. This is the cutest. This is so cute. Thank you so much. I bet I bet Daryl put this one in here for me. What is this? Oh my god, how fun! Oh, Kylo Ren came a little loose, but that's fine. I got E6000. Get him back into place in no time. Look at this. That's so cool. It's a frame with my name, with then it's got Darth Vader and Stormtroopers with a Kylo Ren and a First Order Trooper in it. It's a little shadow box frame. It's a, a, and the little Lego characters, little mini things. This is so cool. This is awesome. This is so fun. Thank you so much. Ooh, some, oh, that's cool. DualShock 4 light bar decals. Wow, it's got a PlayStation, PlayStation symbol, and it's all, all these logos that match the games. This is really, really cool. Overwatch stuff. Little Nightmares, Prey, which I'm loving by the way right now. I cannot put that game down. ESO Morrowind, The Last of Us. This is so cool. Look at that. That's awesome. I think I have two controllers. I think I'm going to use the PlayStation logo and the Last of Us one. Yeah, this is awesome. Thank you. Oh, here's the spoilers. We'll save that for after. Mm. Yes, Dairy Milk, Whole Nut. Love it. This is going to be gone by the end of the day. I can guarantee it. This stuff is so good. You guys have the best candy over there. The best. And then, Phantom Menace, the Nabu Royal Guard. That's so cute. Oh my God, he'll go perfect with the rest of my collection. Thank you so much. Look at her, can you? She's already in the box, she already knows. You will get your turn in just a minute. What's this? Whoa, some collectible cards. What is this? Whoa, Batman! 132 cards plus 22 stickers. Holy shit. This is awesome. These are like the older ones too. <gasps> A daring escape. Yeah, this is this is really awesome. Check it out. I have I have a little card box here you know, that is meant just for stuff like this that I keep all my other collectible cards in. Because that's exactly where these will find a home after I go through and look at every single one of them. This is super awesome. Thank you so much. Whoa! Star Wars Black Series. I love the Black Series stuff, but this is all the ships. The ships are one of my favorite parts of Star Wars. It's got Millennium Falcon, TIE Fighter, Poe's X-Wing, Big's X-Wing. This is so cool. I love I love Black Series. And my guest bathroom is all Star Wars stuff. So that's exactly where these are gonna go. I'm gonna take them out of the box and display them with the rest of my Black Series stuff. This is so cool. Yay, thank you. You guys know me so well. And then, of course, what she's waiting for. Doggy treats. What are these? You got some some Markies? Some doggy treats? Oh, Marrow Bone stuff. She loves that stuff. She loves it. Oh. Yeah, you like these? Yes, you do. Thank you so much. Her and Hero are gonna love these. In fact, they have, um, we're pet sitting for a friend's dog, so they've been having little doggy sleepovers um, this weekend, so they're gonna have dog sleepover snacks. <laughs> thank you, thank you so much, guys. There's spoilers in there, so let's open up the card first. Oh, it's so pretty, it's pink and sparkly. Very good friend, happy birthday, hope today is full of Lovely surprises and lots of life's little luxuries. Rachel to a very special friend on your birthday. Thank you. Wishing you a really wonderful birthday. Lots of love from Jean, Bill, and Smoke Dog. Thank you, guys. You guys always send me so much stuff and you know me so well and, and you're so sweet to me. Oh my gosh. Thank you. Now to the spoilers letter. Oh, first there's just a regular letter. Dear Rachel. 
Hope this letter finds you in the best of health and Yoshin Hero too. It does, thank you. Hope the two boxes have reached you in good condition. Oh, oh, this one's from you guys too. Oh, ah, I'll write you the leader letter and then I'll get to the second box. Holy crap, thank you. Um, Hope your mom and dad and your sisters are okay too. They're doing great um, as we are here in UK. Oh good, I'm glad to hear you guys are doing well as well. <laughs> In October, we'll be in London for Comic-Con. Oh, I wish I could go. I remember I went to MCM London Comic-Con one year and had so much fun. The best time. I'm hoping to go back again soon. Um, if you are, I will be coming down with a friend of mine. Also having trouble finding your Loot Crate videos. Oh yeah, I haven't done Loot Crate in a while. I don't get Loot Crate anymore. Um, it was just getting to become just too much just stuff constantly. Um, and a lot of it also is, you know, Loot Crate branded, which is totally fine, but it just, uh, yeah, I don't do Loot Crate videos anymore. <laughs> Smoke Dog has two questions for you. What did you think of the movie Juice? I'm a terrible person. I still haven't watched it yet. Um, I'm so sorry, but I, I promise I'll watch it. I promise, I promise, I promise. What I need to do is bring it with me next time I'm on a plane, and then I can watch it then. Yeah, because that's really the only time I really watch a lot of movies, because I don't watch a lot of movies or TV just hanging around the house. Sometimes I will when I'm working on cosplay stuff, I'll put something on in the background, but um, I wanna watch your movie and actually like watch it and not just have it playing in the background because I don't want to pay a lot of attention. But generally, when I'm just home, I don't watch a lot of stuff. So that's why it would work best. If I just bring it with me on a plane, and then I'll watch it on the plane because that's when I do a lot of my watching of things. <laughs> Um, also, since I last wrote to you, have you seen the movie Suicide Squad? Harley Quinn was the best in it, and you should have uh, played her part because you look just as good. Oh, thanks. <laughs> and would have played it ten times better. Who was your favorite character in Suicide Squad? Um, first of all, thank you. <laughs> Second, I haven't seen it. I probably won't see it. Um, I just don't watch a lot of things. Like I, <laughs> I was saying before, I uh, don't sit still very well, so I play a lot of games, and when I'm not playing something, I'm always trying to work on stuff. I don't just kind of sit still too well, so that's why I don't watch a lot of things, because that requires you to sit, especially in theaters. I hate going to theaters. Um, I mean, maybe I will watch it, but it'll probably be one of those times just where I'm working on cosplay or something, and I have it playing on in the background. Also, Rachel, wish you would go back to YouTube for the live chat. Are you considering buying Tekken 7 on PS4? Love to challenge you and see how good you are. I'm not that good on Tekken, for sure. I can guarantee you. Street Fighter or Mortal Kombat? Definitely, I can kick some ass on that. But I'm not good at Tekken. I'm, <laughs> I've never really been good at Tekken, so you would totally destroy me. I've seen Batman and Superman on Blu-ray, and I didn't rate it at all. Um, I still haven't seen that yet, either. I'm so behind on everything. Uh, movies and TV. And then a small message from Mr. Bill. He loves heavy metal and took your advice on Rob Zombie. Now he owns three CDs of his music. He thinks he's a good artist. I love Rob Zombie, even back when it was White Zombie. Uh, I, I'm a fan. I haven't heard any of the newer stuff. Is there a newer album out? I don't, I'm saying I'm a fan of somebody don't know about new albums. Um, yeah, but I Rob Zombie's good. And his movies are good too. Um, I don't know, Mr. Bill, if you're into, like, um, gory horror movies and stuff. Last House on the Left and, um, The Devil's Rejects are really good. I didn't like, uh, that one that was weird with all the chanting and stuff where his wife was the lead character. Uh, that movie I didn't like so much. Also, a small message from Miss Jean. Rachel, you would love my Voorhees burgers. Oh my gosh, what are Voorhees burgers? That sounds amazing. But it also sounds like it might be made out of camp kids, which I don't know if that would actually taste amazing. But I do love burgers, so I would totally give them a try. <laughs> hope to see you in October at London Comic Con. I hope. I don't don't have any plans so far of being there, but I would totally be up for going. Just remember to write, um, send them emails or whatever, and let them know that you'd love to see me there, and uh, and that they should bring me out as a guest. Because if they offer, I would totally go. I promise. Love from Miss Jean, Mr. Bill, and Daryl, aka Smoke Dog. Also, I placed in the box your birthday card for May 18th. Thank you so much, you guys. Thank you. Okay, let me, before I open spoilers, let me open up the second box. <gasps> what? Oh my god. It's a giant talking Yoda. Oh my god. This is so awesome. <laughs> <laughs> so cute! I hope you 
hope I'm never 900 years old because that would be terrible. Oh, he still has a string on his neck. Sorry about that, Yoda. <laughs> He's so cute. <laughs> he liked his hug. Thank you so much, you guys. Thank you, Miss Jean, Mr. Bill, and Daryl. He's adorable. And look, you can put the hood on so if it's chilly outside, he doesn't have to be cold. Oh my god. I love this. Oh, I love him so much. This is so sweet. Thank you guys so much. Spoilers! I like this part because this is where they tell me who got what, and I always like to guess. So from Miss Jean and Mr. Bill, the Star Wars Naboo Royal Guard. Oh man, I would have thought that was from Daryl. Star Wars Mini Ships, the Cadbury's Whole Nut Bar, mmm, and the two boxes of Markies for Yoshi and Hero. And then from Daryl was the Big Yoda Plush, thank you, the Darth Vader Voice Changer, Batman Movie Cards, and Dual Shock for and then the dual shop light bar decals. And then the last present is from all of them. It's a Star Wars box frame. It was made specially for me. Yeah! Thank you so much. And then the frame was actually handmade by Kylie, Kyra, and Carl. Thank you guys so much. That means the absolute world to me. Thank you. I don't know how to say thank you enough. That's so, such a sweet, sweet idea. You guys are amazing. Thank you. Okay, so the next box is pretty big, so I'm just gonna from it. Um, there's spoilers, so I won't look at that yet. And everything's kind of wrapped in separate things, but I had already opened it because I got the okay from Rich to go ahead and open it and grab Prey out of it because I couldn't wait anymore. I needed to play it right away, so I grabbed Prey. So thank you so much for Prey. I've been loving it. I've been playing it tons, and I will have a review up on YouTube soon. Um, so let's unwrap things. From La- oh my god, it's from Last Fly. I know what this is. Ah, I'm so excited! <sighs> look at this perfect backpack. It's Darth Vader backpack. Look at this. Look how cute. Oh my god, I love being a girl because I get stuff like this. It's so amazing. Ah, I already have the, the Rebel one, the Rebel Pilot one, and I didn't have the Darth Vader one yet, and this is the best ever. Thank you. I'm going to wear this to Disneyland next time I go. I think I'm going on Monday. I'm going to wear this. Thank you so much. I love it. Oh, what is this? Oh, Guild Wars gem cards? What? Oh my god, Jared, Guild Wars $100 in Guild Wars gem cards. Ah! This is so great. I'm gonna buy myself some pretty ass shit. Wait a second, wait a fucking second. 2,000 gems a card, that's math. Four, five, six, six, seven, eight, oh, 8,000 gems. Do you know what's cool stuff I'm gonna buy? My characters are gonna look pimp with all the cool weapons. Oh my god. Ah, thank you. I want to like throw it up in the air and, and roll around in them like money. This is so great. Thank you so much. <gasps> Darksiders 2 Death I can never say this. Darksiders 2 Definitive Edition. I'm just going to give up. But this! Oh my god, yes! I got the Humble Bundle recently. The THQ Humble Bundle that came with uh, this for uh, PlayStation 4 and the freaking thing doesn't work. I tried to message them about it and they were like, Sorry, we have nothing we can do about it. And um, anytime it tries to load, especially the main menu that's got the fog effect, crashes every time. Piece of shit. But yay, it's on Xbox One. Yay, thank you. And well, the remastered Darksider. Look, ah, this is one of my favorite series. I love this. I've been wanting to replay the second one so bad. Um, and I was so crushed when my PlayStation 4 version kept crashing. So this is perfect. Thank you. This is amazing. Look at that. Yeah. Yeah, girl. This is amazing. <laughs> Whoa, it's got all of it. It's got art, I mean, scenes or whatever, and characters from all of the mass specs, even Andromeda. This is crazy. Thank you. This is what? This I'm definitely going to take with me on a plane. And then a cardboard thing. <gasps> what? The Mass Effect Andromeda art book. Oh, holy shit. 
I want to take it out of the cardboard so bad, and I will. I mean, the plastic. I will. I will. I will. Just not when I, when I, when I can take it out and and, and be careful. And oh my God, but look how beautiful. Oh my God, it's so it's my Pathfinder box, and this is amazing. This is so amazing. I love art books. I love them. I love to just feel like I'm fancy and look through the art books. Yay! Thank you. Oh, yay! More Mass Effect stuff! <sighs> Mass Effect hoodie! Look how cute! Yay! I'm gonna wear this and be like, oh, I'm a Pathfinder! I love this! Thank you! Also, crayons for the coloring book. Smart man. Yay! This is... <laughs> this is awesome. Oh man, a whole bunch of... Oh! Mass Effect socks! Look at all these Mass Effect socks. Yay! Oh, these are awesome. <laughs> these are perfect. I love this. Thank you. Oh, these are fun. Look at this. The classic Nintendo controller socks. Look how colorful. And then to go with those, the classic colors. Yay! <laughs> Where do you find these things? This is so fun. Thank you. All right, so a few more things. First up is Nathan Drake Uncharted Sack Boy. Oh, I love everything Nathan Drake. Look, look at his face. He's so sweet. Yay, this is so cute. I love Little Big Planet. We need another one. We need another Little Big Planet because these games are super fun. Yay, thank you. Whoa, two pop finals. I got Liam from Mass Effect Andromeda. And then also PB. I'm gonna have to expand my Mass Effect shelf now. Or actually, I think Mass Effect has more than one shelf in one of my display cases. I'm gonna have to expand it now. Ooh, look at this. Whoa, look at this. Mass Effect. More Mass Effect. Look how angry he is. Why'd someone put me in this box? Oh, and then two more. Sarah Ryder. I I actually love my my Ryder more than I did my Commander Shepard, and I know that's it's a terrible thing to say, but I actually did. I loved how sarcastic Ryder was. She was just so bullshitting and sarcastic and charming, and yeah, I, I loved her. And then also one of my favorite crew members on The Tempest is Jal. I loved him. He was pretty great. Yeah, he was one of the new uh, races in Andromeda, and I can't remember what the name of his race was, but yeah. I wanted this for so long. It's the NECA. Nathan Drake, Uncharted 4 action figure. He comes with two heads. Oh my god, he's so handsome. Look at him. Isn't he the best? Oh, Nathan Drake, I love you. I love you, Dad. The handsomest man ever in video games. Also, Handsome Jack is super handsome. Uh, but he's got to wear a mask. Nathan Drake is handsome without a mask. Yay! Oh my god, thank you Rich so much for all my goodies. I absolutely adore everything. Everybody who sent me cards and gifts and again everything on, on social media, all the all the happy birthdays and you guys are so good to me. You are so so good to me. Um, I just don't even know how I can give back as much as you've given to me but I'm gonna keep on trying as much as I can because you guys deserve the best. I love you all so much and um, yeah until my next video. I love you guys. Oh and Yoshi says thank you as well. Say thank you. Thank you guys. <laughs>